Welcome to Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2015 Coffee Mug Tutorials. I'm Johannes Goodmanson, founder of Enecta, a Microsoft Gold certified partner. Using a coffee mug as an example, I'll show you how to create items, purchase orders, sales orders, manage inventory, and much more. So go ahead and grab your own cup of joe and let's get started. Hello again and welcome to the coffee mug tutorials. In this video I wanted to just go a little bit to the uh, user interface and uh, uh, take a look at that, go through what you see when you log into NAV and what everything means. So kind of taking a few steps back from uh, what we have been doing before. Um, so when I log in I'm actually get my own screen. Uh, I'm logged in as a U, uh, sales order processor. So my own screen is tailored for uh, sales order processing. Uh, and this is called a role center. So my role center is geared towards that. Uh, now what I see here are a few tiles. Now these tiles are configurable, but um, f as a sales order processor, I see sales quotes, which ones are open, uh, and sales orders. I also see the sales orders that are released but haven't shipped. I see the ones that have been partially shipped and those that are delayed, that uh, uh, the shipment date has passed already. Um, also, if there are any sales return orders or any credit memos. I can also see our trailing sales orders, how many for uh, what month. And um, my customers and my items, I can actually select customers in here and keep my own list and same for the items. Uh, here on the left hand side are quick links to um, various forms like the sales orders, quotes, um, items, customers, journals, etc. Uh, and then I can get into different tabs here to see different things. Here, Here's the history or posted documents. And if I go over here, I see the entire main menu of NAV down in departments. Uh, I can then go back like this to where I was and back again. So here forward and back to where I was navigating. Down here is the company that I'm logged into. This is the work date. The demo system actually puts you into 2014. And here is me uh, as you know, my username as I'm logged in as. Uh, we can actually see the company several places. You can see it all the way here, all the way up here, and up here. Um, now, up here we have the ribbon, which are actions. So I can quickly get into certain actions over here. And that's customizable as well. Just to show you a little bit of how this is customizable, I can go into here and say customize ribbon. And let's say if I didn't want to see the order summary, I never use that. I can just hit remove hit OK, and then the system has taken that away. I can also, up here is sort of a secret button, but that gives me access to change the work date. So that changes the date that the system is set to be. Change the language, if I had multiple languages. Select the server, so that would be the actual database server, um, or the service between the database server and the client and the company. Um, here I can also get quickly into the customize of the ribbon, the actual page, navigation pane, and I can reset everything. Also have access to the help and to close the program I can close that over here. Now a really handy dandy thing here is the search where I can just type in what I need. Let's say I want to go to my vendors and as long as I have access to that I can get to that. Even though it did not, it wasn't in any of the menus here except the departments, which gave me access to everything. Just another thing on uh, customization. If I go in here and to customize and customize this page, I can actually uh, get a list of the, the boxes over here on my role center. And let's say if I don't use my customers, I can remove that and I don't use my items, I can remove that. Um, and let's say I don't want to see the Outlook, just keep this very clean. Hit OK. 
and now you've seen that I've cleaned up the user interface. Um, there is there are different options for different role centers, so there could be more or less um, boxes in here. And that was a quick overview of the role center for the sales order processor and role centers in general.